Hey, what's up? It's Sue Ann. We're back, me and my, doing street talk. And uh, right now we are hanging out in uh, Wellman 126. And we are in the Wellman Student Lounge. And I'm trying to be quiet because there's people like studying. And we're here with Jessica and Mike right there. And uh, what's your guys' majors? I'm an animal science major. I'm a genetics major. That's brave. So Valentine's Day is coming up. Any plans? Going to class. That's pretty much it. I have lab on Valentine's Day night, so. <laughs> and how about you? Um, I don't have much going on. Do you guys have boyfriends or girlfriends, or are you just single and chilling, or what, what's the deal? I have a boyfriend, and he's from out of town. He goes to San Francisco State, so we both have classes, so we'll probably talk on the phone, I know. <laughs> Dear, and how about you? I'm single. Single? There you go, ladies, single guy right here. Okay, well, thank you very much for your time. We'll let you go back to your studying. Um, we are here talking to Dave. And Dave, what's your um, year and major? I'm a sophomore and I'm a biological sciences major. Very cool. Very cool. And, oh, yes, yes, of course. Are you single or do you have a girlfriend? Uh, currently, I am single, yes. Okay. All right, there you go, ladies. We got a single guy here. So if you're, if you're into the Asian guy thing, this is the dude for you. Okay. Um, so I'm gonna ask I'm gonna ask you the same question. So any plans for Valentine's Day? Um, currently no, not yet. No. Yeah. Are you just gonna sit at home and maybe you know eat chocolate or something? That's what girls do. Well, I hope not. I I hope I I'll have something to do. You know. So. Right on. Okay. Well, there is this guy who's at, who's gonna be at Cafe Bernardo, and he's gonna be sitting there around dinner time. So if you want to go and maybe hunt for girls with him, we can you know set things up. For you. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I did not imply that. <laughs> okay, okay. Now, lastly, we are here at the Circle K meeting, invading privacy. So, anything you want to say about the club? I just want to say that uh, Circle K is a community service club. It's an international organization, and it's a great way to meet new people and to um, to do service projects with the community and give back to you know to the community. I guess. Awesome, awesome. Any last words to any of our viewers out there? Um. <laughs> Okay, my phone number is 530-297-6102. Uh, I think he was actually going to do that. Okay, um, well, this is Sue Ann, and we're going to leave Circle K, and uh, yeah, we're out of here. And I am here with Circle K President Khan, and Khan, we're asking um, some people some questions, so if you wouldn't mind, we'd like to ask you. Okay, Valentine's Day is coming up. All right. So, uh, first of all, you got a girlfriend? Yes, I do. Okay, how long you guys been together? Uh, a couple months now. All right, all right. So what are the big plans for Valentine's Day? Um, I don't really have any right now. She lives far away, so I got to look at her schedule and everything. Okay, you know, like, as the guy, it, you yeah. know, you have to be chivalrous and romantic and stuff. So any ideas about maybe driving down and, like, going to surprise her? Um, I'd have to take the Amtrak. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Oh, I'll, I'll play her in a song, and I'll sing. Oh, so you're a singer? I'm in an acapella group. Oh, very cool, very cool. Well, sorry, ladies, this guy's taken, but... We're just going to go down to reserves and look for a friend, and then we'll probably leave right after that. Okay. Okay. Hang on a second. Wait, record me talking. Like, we're here at the library. Oh, Hey. Oh, yeah, I'm on TV? Or is this a... Uh, is this... <laughs> What's up? I've never seen this guy before in my life. Hey, mom, look, I'm a movie star. <laughs> am, am I really on TV? Yeah. We're tape, are we taping? Yeah, we're taping. All right, uh, so ask me a question. Name? My name is Chuck. Chuck Vong, uh, UC Davis, uh, year third right year. What's your major? Uh, biochem, comm sci. Yeah. Hey, hey, what are you doing for Valentine's Day? Uh, hopefully getting laid. <laughs> And that's it. Right. Thanks. Okay, now we are at the Davis Library harassing some students who are trying to be studious, unlike us. And uh, by the way, we're interns, so we're not just like freaky people on the street, you know, with a camera. Okay, what are your first names again? Jessica. Michael Douglas. <laughs> okay, and the question of the night is, what are you doing for Valentine's Day, and are you single? Um, I'm going to be with a hot, um, tall, dark, and handsome foreign man. <laughs> I'm spending it with Catherine Zeta Jones in my home in uh, Spain. 
Okay, and one last question. What do you look for in the opposite sex? Potential dating partner. Just what I just said. Tall, dark, handsome, and foreign. That's a very important somebody, component. Somebody kind of like me. <laughs> Ooh, it kind of sounds like some sexual tension going on here. Okay. Okay, okay. One more question, then we'll leave you guys alone. What's your major? I am international agriculture and economics. Political science. Awesome. All right. This is Suman, and we are out of here. We're back, and we're going to go back to these people we were talking to because there's a girl who would like to say a message to all the viewers out there. Amy. And what's your major? Linguistics. What's your, what's your Third. Um, someone who appreciates me. <laughs> you know, guys, that's all girls want. We just want to be appreciated for our minds and not our bodies. I want to boycott Valentine's Day. You know, I'm with you. I say all girls who are single should wear black. I'm telling you, Valentine's Day sucks major ass. Yeah. Yes. And I think I just found my new best friend. Okay, thanks, Amy. <laughs> Bye. Number one. Okay. Hi, we are back at the MU, and uh, this will probably be our last stop. We're going to try to find some people to talk here. It's kind of hard sometimes, a little shy. So uh, we're going to see what people are up to at the MU at uh, 7 o'clock p.m. So what's your name? Lily. Aaron. Okay, and uh, what year, you guys? Second year. Second year. Second year. Two more years to go. Are you guys Maybe done for three? Maybe <laughs> three. Are you guys done for the day? Yes, definitely. Thank God. Yeah. Yes. So um, Valentine's Day is coming up, as you know. And uh, do you guys have any special plans with your honeys? Maybe dinner, a balloon ride, over the river. No, I don't know. <laughs> it's just a hint. 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 <laughs> No honey to speak of, but looking. Six. What's your number? <laughs> You'll just have to find me on campus. Okay, you guys off right now? Yes. Gotta catch the bus. Gotta catch the bus. Okay, don't wanna run. Well, we'll see ya next time. Bye. 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 I'm standing in front of very studious people here, and uh, we're gonna get their names. What's your name? I'm Liz. Liz? Ryan. What are you guys studying here? We're actually working on a Bible study. Yeah. That's it. Um, kinda. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I should figure it out. Do you guys like the class? Um, actually, it's for a extracurricular kind of thing. Yeah. Yeah. So. Like I said, very studious people. Um, well, Valentine's Day is coming up. Do you guys have any special plans with anybody? <laughs> My roommates? <laughs> yeah, probably not. We're just probably going to hang out, do some girly thing. Sounds cool. Um, I always try to just find some random girl on Valentine's Day. Yeah, <laughs> that's, that's my usual plan, so. Well, are you going to be hanging out at a particular place you'd like people to know? <laughs> well, I'm usually at Cafe Roma, so if anyone's interested, you can find me there. Cafe Roma, February 14th, uh, dinner time? Sounds good. Okay. Thanks. Yeah. <laughs> and we're up. Coffee House, ba House Bakery, and I'm standing in front of lots and lots of sweeties, sweet things here. So um, we're going to talk to, what's your name? Yerma. Yerma? What year are you, Yerma? I'm a first year. First year? So how do you like it at Davis so far? It's nice. Yeah. I've lived here for a while, so it's okay. Really? So what do you recommend here? What's good? Um, Anything with chocolate. Not the cookies, but the cakes are pretty good. Speaking about chocolate, uh, Valentine's Day is coming up. Do you have any special plans with a certain somebody? Um, I'm going to be with my boyfriend. We've been together for like nine months. You guys going to go out have a nice dinner and any other thing? Um, actually, he's supposed to like cook a dinner for me, and so it's supposed to be kind of romantic. Oh, that's, that's nice. That's nice. Okay, well, I wish you guys have, hope you guys have fun on Valentine's Day. Uh, what's your name? James. James, uh, what year are you? Uh, junior. Junior, what are you studying here? Uh, data structures, no, databases. Interesting. Fine. Fun. So, uh, what do you hope to do with uh, your major? Uh, work at McDonald's. Work at McDonald's. Someone's got to do those fries and flip those burgers for us, right? You know? <laughs> so, uh, Valentine's Day is coming up. Do you have any plans with a specific someone? Yeah, my girlfriend. 
Uh, wait, does she go here? Uh, no, she goes to community college. Uh, what is? Are you planning anything special or romantic for her? Uh, I'll probably take her out to dinner or something like that. Sounds good. And uh, who's your friend here? What's your name? Darren. What is that? Darren. Darren? Oh, I know a guy named Darren. Um, so are you studying the same thing? Um, yeah, I'm just doing homework with him. Cool, so you guys have class together? Um, yeah. <laughs> Sounds pretty obvious, right? Class together. Um, so what do you have planned for Valentine's Day? No, nothing really. I don't have a girlfriend or anything, so... Just gonna, just gonna chill out with your friends at home, watch movies? Most likely. Sounds like a cool thing to do. Yeah. Uh, no. <laughs> We're here at the bowling alley at the uh, Lower MU, a popular hangout place for Davis students to just relieve some stress for midterms. And uh, we're going to go talk to some people, some uh, bowlers here, so you can follow me. We're here with a bunch of bowlers at the Lower MU bowling alley. And I'm here with, what's your name? This is Aaron. I'm Aaron. Aaron, uh, what year are you, Aaron? I'm a senior. Senior? Uh, you got any plans for Valentine's Day? Uh, what, no, not yet. No? Haven't quite figured it You're out. You're not going to go out to the clubs and look for I some uh, girls out there? See what the future holds. So, you want to... No. What about you? What are you doing for uh, Valentine's Day? Are you busy? I hope so. <laughs> Let's see what my boyfriend has in plan for me. <laughs> okay, I'm here with, what's your name? I'm Zach. Zach. Wow, what a nice name. Thanks. Um, so, what year are you, Zach? I'm a fourth year. Fourth year? You got, you're going to graduate this year? Yep, that's the plan. What are you going to do after that? What am I going to do after that? Uh, I'm going to graduate school to get a PhD in molecular virology. Wow, mo molecular vi Vi virology. virology. I can't even say that. <laughs> um, that's how complicated it is. So, Zach, what are your plans for Valentine's Day? Mm, for Valentine's Day? Well, I'm flying out to get interviewed in uh, Alabama that day. So I'm going to have to take my girlfriend out like a day early. So I'm going to try to surprise her. Go out to dinner or something. Maybe go out to the beach or I don't know. Something special. That sounds very good. Very good. Anything else you'd like to add? Want to say hi to anybody here? Um, I'd like to say what's up to my boy Kenzo. Couldn't be here tonight because he sold out. That's all I'll say. All right. Thanks a lot for the interview. Okay, I'm taping and I'm here with, what's your first name? Justin. Justin, and are you in Kai fi Yes, I am. All right, right on. Okay, now Justin, the question of the night is, do you have a girlfriend? And if you do, are you doing anything for Valentine's Day? No, I don't have a girlfriend. So no plans for Valentine's Day? No plans as of yet. I'm sorry, ladies. We, got, we have another single man here, so you know, you want to hook it up. You want to shout out your phone number, your address, or whatever? I live at 217 Russell. First door on the left. Just leave me a message. Right on. Thank you, Justin. Okay, Suman, we're here at the pool hall, or, you know, whatever, game, and people playing pool, and we're going to try to find some people to talk to. Hi, how are you? I'm doing all right. Can I ask you a question? Okay. This is for DC TV, and we're interns, so we're not just, like, sleazy people. Do you have a girlfriend? Yes. And any plans for Valentine's Day? No. No? Not yet. Aw. Dude, that's a long time away. I got, like, a month or something. You know, girls like it when you plan early. Yeah, but this early? Come on. I got a lot of other stuff that I got to deal with before Valentine's Day. What's your first name? David. And are you a student? Yes, I am. Where are you? Senior. Senior. And what are you studying? History and philosophy. Awesome. Awesome. Well, thank you for your time. You're welcome. And plan something for Valentine's Day. Okay. okay what's your first name? Alvin. Alvin. And what's your, what's your major? Microbiology. Microbiology. What's your year? Fourth year. Fourth year. Awesome. Graduating this year? No, sticking around another year. Awesome. Fifth year super senior. It's all about that. So you got a girlfriend? Yeah. Any plans for Valentine's Day? Am I going to get in trouble for this? No, no, no. No plans. Not yet. No plans. You sound just like that guy over there. No plans for Valentine's Day? You don't have anything planned. No flowers, no candy. Are you serious? <laughs> Nothing. Anything you want to say to your girlfriend just in case she sees this and knows that you have made like no plans? I'm going to get in trouble, aren't I? <laughs> um, um, don't worry, I have something planned. Uh, spring break. There we go. Ooh, sounds like a trip. All right. Okay, hey, it's Suman. We're back here on Street Talk. And now uh, Maya and I have made our way all through campus, and we are here at the MU bus stop. And we're actually on Beeline, and the bus driver was really cool to like, turn on the lights and stuff for us. So uh, we're here with a passenger. And what's your first name? Um, Guadalupe. 
Okay. And our, what year are you? I'm a second year. And what's your major? Um, Chicano Studies and Sociology. Awesome. Awesome. You got a boyfriend? Yes. Any plans for Valentine's Day? Not yet. <laughs> Is this because your boyfriend hasn't planned anything or you're just too busy or what? I'm too busy. Way too busy. Too busy? Yeah. So do you expect anything? Maybe like flowers or anything? Yeah, he already said he was going to give me something, so. Very cool. Yeah. Very cool. Okay, so what's your first name? Kim. Kim. Okay, how long have you been driving Unitrans? Um, since spring quarter last year. Awesome. Awesome. What year are you? I'm a fourth year. Major? Political science and international relations. Oh, very cool. Very cool. So you got a boyfriend? No, I don't, actually. So no plans for Valentine's Day? I'm going to celebrate with all my single friends. Very good. See, we're, we're trying to petition to get all the single girls who are black, and, but no one wants to do that. I guess that's just my perverted idea of the world. Okay, anyways, so do you like driving buses? I love it, absolutely. Pretty crazy hours, or they keep it pretty uh, tame for you? Um, you pick your own hours, so if they're really crazy, it's your own fault. So. Awesome, awesome. So are you going to keep doing this for a while? Yeah, until I graduate next year. So Very it's pretty cool. cool. Very cool. Okay, tell us your worst like bus driving story. Or embarrassing. Um, I was driving the T-Line, which does the Emerson and the high school kids, and it was about two weeks before school started this year, and this kid got on my bus, and he missed his bus stop, so he started like calling me names because I wouldn't pull over in the middle of a really busy intersection to let him and his friends off. So when he got off, he started spitting at my bus and then threw gang signs at me and started calling me nasty names. It was really quite funny. Wow. And who said it was tame here in Davis? Good. I, you know, I'd freak out if someone started throwing gang signs at me. I'd be like, oh, no. I'd, I would just run him over. And that's just me. Though. No, you could add him at the next one because the, the next time I drove that kid, before we, he even, like, we started the line, I got on and I was like, if you try anything with me, you're off the bus because we can kick kids off the bus. We can even call the police on him. So he knew that if he really messed with me, he'd be busted. Very cool. And hey, viewers out there, we have another single girl. So uh, she's very cute, nice. She's educated, all, you know, almost graduated. She has a job, so she won't be mooching off you. So there you go.